Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into the latest game recap, where we witnessed an intense battle on the field. Let's jump into some key takeaways from the post-game interview with the coach and players. It was a tough game, and we saw some positives, despite Peyton experiencing some cramps. He stepped back in and really contributed 2,433 passing with over 240 yards. That scramble at the end was something beautiful to watch. Our fans were amazing with a sea of red in the stand, and we truly appreciate their support. There were many good things to build on. We had a strong third down performance, going 7 of 12, thanks to Matt Nagy's great offensive strategy. Defensively, Nazi led the charge again with crucial tackles, including Dana's big strip sack. And I can't forget to mention Spencer stepping in under pressure, replacing a future Hall of Famer, isn't easy, but he delivered. However, we need to clean up our act with penalties. Nine penalties for 90 yards is too much. We have to focus on getting off the field defensively and sustaining drives offensively. Pat, how does it feel to have the game on the line once again? It's always intense. I just trust my instincts and make plays as they come. That scramble was about getting those extra yards when it mattered most. And what was your mindset during that crucial drop? We aimed to get as close to field goal range as possible. We executed well, and I have full confidence in our kicker. He's got a strong leg, and he proved it. Asterix Noah, what was going through your mind on your second touchdown? Asterix, Asterix Noah. Asterix, asterix. It was all about recognizing the coverage. We practiced this stuff weekly. I saw the defense shift, alerted the team, and Pat trusted me to make the play. It all came together. Asterix, how do you feel about the overall performance of the offense? We moved the ball well, but we need to execute better in the red zone. We're improving, but consistency is key. Close wins can be a double-edged sword. It's great for building experience, especially heading into the playoffs, but I think we'd all appreciate a bit more breathing room in future games. Thanks for tuning in to our post-game recap. Leave a comment with your thoughts on the game, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more highlights and analyses. Catch you next time.